Hello and welcome to Advanced Driving Tuition. In this video, uh, someone asked me to upload the Stockport Town Centre route. Uh, I'm in a Bradbury Test Centre. We're going to do is a Bradbury Test Centre route. Uh, so we start from the nearest point. I'm parked up outside the Bradbury Test Centre, which is just behind me here. So we're going to follow this test route from here. So making sure everything is okay before we move off. We do the six point checks all along. I start the car, first gear, just making sure again one more time, everything's fine. You will arrive at your destination Signal and I can see someone's PM. coming. And we move off when we're ready. So at this junction we're going left, so center mirror, left mirror, signal left. Turn left, then at the end of the road, turn right. So on this junction, there's always obstruction, cars parked on the left and car parked on the right, block your view. So make sure to peep and creep here, nice and slowly move forward, slowly, slowly. There's a big gap coming from the right. Just making sure everything's fine. We join the new road, check the center mirror, right mirror. At the end of the road, turn right. So we're going right at this traffic light coming up ahead. So there's two lanes, one go left and one go right. We look in the center mirror, look on the right mirror, we signal right, position ourselves nicely, give Turn enough right. way to this van. And then we position ourselves onto the right side. Lights are green, so we're okay to go ahead. Keep an eye on the van there. We're going straight into the left lane. There's only one lane anyway. So we go straight into this lane here, check the center mirror, check the right mirror, see everything's okay. There's a big lorry, so stay back nice and slowly. Look in the center mirror before you use the brake. After 200 yards, go right on the roundabout, second exit. Now the center is asking us to go right to the roundabout second exit, which is a stock port. So if you look on that sign there, it says Bradbury at the first exit, second exit is A560, which is a stock port. So if you look on the marking on the road, the both marking says A560, but the left one Go says right A560 on east, exit. right one says A560 west. So we're using a west one. The big gap coming up, we'll go straight into the right lane. So we give a left signal and look in the left mirror, everything's fine. We position ourselves on the left side of the road now. So we're taking the left lane, which is a Stockport town center now. Check in the center, right mirror, everything's fine. The roundabout coming up again. After We're following the A560 West. Yards, cross the roundabout, first exit. So, first exit, we're looking cross on the, the right. Big gap coming exit. up. Look in the left mirror, everything's fine. And we can speed up nicely here. So, this is our exit coming up. Center mirror, left mirror. And then we give signal left here. Can see the speed is 50 miles an hour here now so first thing first straight the car nicely check the center mirror right mirror and now we can speed up so i'm already in the fourth gear we can go to the fifth gear as well now checking the mirrors again after 800 yards go straight on so the center is asking me to go straight on there's a two lanes so the right, this lane go right as well. So SatNav says go straight on. So if you see the, the white sign coming up says no more non-motorway traffic. So this is where we go in. So we look in the center mirror, left mirror, signal left as we're going left, which is straight for us. Right lane is to go right now. So looking in the left mirror, and there's a two on. lanes again. So we take this left lane. You can see from far away lights gain red so mirror slowly slowly breaks so we can approach light nicely now if you see the arrow on the road is emerging it's mean two lanes will become one and the road merging from the right as well now Just 
brakes making sure everything's fine nice change this car's already in the right lane so he's gonna go front of us sign says road is merging making sure no one's coming from the right now this arrow telling us there's a two-way traffic now left lane is to go left which is oncoming traffic on the right side which is a right lane speed is still 50 miles an hour so nicely looking in the mirror everything's fine so speed up now So can see the After roundabout coming up. Yards, cross the roundabout, third exit. So we need to follow the Stockport Town Centre sign. So we stay in the middle lane this time. So if you look on the road, it says Town Centre. So we stick to the left middle lane now. Keeping our distance, tight on the tarmac. Back to the first gear, everything is fine. So this roundabout have a seven to eight exit, but the beauty of this roundabout is all marking on the road and has a signs on the top as well. So it's make very easy for us to follow. So as we following the middle lane, so middle lane will become two lanes. Cross so as we go around, lights are still green. So we okay to carry on ahead. If you look on the top there, it says town center on two lanes now. So we pick the left lane, we going around and stay in the left lane now so left lane goes straight ahead and the right lane Take which is the where exit. the blue car is going straight ahead as well on the side of the roundabout there's only one lane so the white blue car here on the right will merge into your left lane so we need to keep an eye on this blue car if they're going exactly the same way where we going so checking the mirror everything's fine there's another car behind us as well on the right lane so blue car has gone there's another car we can keep an eye on this car now yep he's going other way as well so if you see the arrow road merging no one on the right lane so we okay to carry on ahead checking the mirror everything's fine now this road is busy After lots of pedestrian on the road so we need yards, to keep an eye on them when we're driving Second exit. checking then the mirror slowing right. down a little bit people crossing it's fine now now the set nav says cross over the roundabout and turn right so because we're turning right after crossing the roundabout so what we need to do now stay in the right lane instead of taking the left lane the so look in the mirror exit. drop then the gear down right. no one's coming from the right so we go around and we take a right lane straight away so as we are going right now look at the mirror signal right. right then take the third right Now Satan is asking us take a right here and then take a third right. So if you see these lights here, they have a filter arrow. So we just need to wait for the lights. If the arrow comes, we okay to go straight ahead. The green arrow is there for us. So we're waiting for this car to move and we need to keep an eye on the arrow as well. If the arrow disappeared, it means that car is coming out. So this time we have to position ourselves in the middle and look for the safe gap now. Now after this Audi, there's a gap coming up so we go behind the Audi now so Satnav has already told us take your third turn to the right from here checking the mirrors everything's fine so they take this as a first exit after 200 yards turn right so we're approaching the exit now which is uh, turn right from the traffic light now so looking in the center turn mirror right. looking the right mirror signal right arrow pointing me to go into the right lane so I'll go into the right lane which is going right now normally we have a two cars rule applied in the junction so two cars allowed to stop in the junction but this junction is really small so we have to keep an eye if someone's is a big lorry or a big truck front of you only one car is allowed filter arrow is there so we okay to go around go right here now checking the mirror everything is fine center mirror right mirror now speed on this road is 30 miles an hour after 300 yards cross the roundabout second exit so we're taking a second exit as we see on the roundabout 
sign so we need to be in the left lane go the second exit is in Manchester so we stick in this lane now so as we're approaching the roundabout the same Cross rule the roundabout, second exit. approach the roundabout with the second gear keep looking in the right if you see someone we stop and go back to the first gear if we know no one's come in we okay to carry on there's a big gap coming up that's our first exit because we're taking a second exit so as soon as we pass the first exit check the mirrors signal and go left making sure everything is okay behind us so lights red so center mirror start slowing down Make sure you keep your distance because there's a lots of traffic in front of us so two second gap which is on this occasion is not possible to leave a two second gap because there's lots of traffic stopping and moving so as much gap you can see about three car length gap should be okay for us so there's a junction coming up we don't want to block the junction we stay back here we can go a little bit more closer and tired on the road now and break up you can take the gear out because there's lots of traffic here now so even though this car is moving we okay to stay here because we don't want to block the junction people going in and out so we leave this junction empty just like the example that car coming from there they needed that space thank you So you can see the cars moving slowly, slowly. So it means the light's green now. So we're waiting for the silver car. We let the silver car go as well. Checking the mirror, everything's okay. So we stop again with the tire and tarmac. the mirror everything's fine move along with these cars now and stop where you can see the tire and the road clearly again So lights change again, we prepare ourselves back to the first gear just before we move, making sure things are okay. So the signs say the road is merging, so we need to keep two lanes will become one. 
temporary traffic light is a three-way control traffic light. You can see, read the signs there. The red sign says, wait here till the lights are green. So just keep an eye on these signs. The temporary traffic light sign is when the lights are red. So you have to stop before the red sign. Fail to stop before the red sign. It's a serious fault in the test. So we're going back to our side of the road. Look in the mirror, everything's fine. During your test, examiner can ask you around here to stop the car on the left hand side. So we look in the center mirror, left mirror, signal left. We can see this is a nice space to stop. So whenever you're going closer, make sure your door handle, the back door handle is parallel to the curb. So we can stop the car here. And when you stop, they will ask you, thank you very much. Drive on or move off when you're ready. So looking from all along, from the left shoulder to the right shoulder, give a signal because I see there's a car coming behind us. After 200 yards, turn left, then take the second left. So as we're going left, so we need to stay in the left side of the lane now. Because the left lane is to go straight and left. Because these cars parked on the left, they have taken us some of our road. So what we need to do is okay to drive on the center line now, which is this white line. wide and open now so we're okay to drive in our lane now so we're going After left to the lights 80 yards turn left then take the second left so center mirror left mirror we can signal left here because we're close to the lights and there's no turn before that turn <coughs> Nice green, check in the center mirror, right mirror, looking at the left mirror, making sure there's no cyclist is there. Quick look to the left mirror again. So we're gonna finish the video here. So thank you very much. Hope you like the video. Please don't forget to subscribe, leave the comment and like the video. Thank you. A good day. Bye.